So he's not too happy about the guy that's trimming the hedges right now. Do you not like him? Do you not like that guy? No. Mom, I don't know what he's doing. What's he doing out there, Mom? Why is he out there? Where's he got that thing? What's he doing outside? Zoe. She's a cute bubby. Good morning. So I decided I'm no longer gonna record videos in my car because that natural light outside just makes me look terrible. Um, no, I'm just kidding. I really don't care. Um, home from the gym, checking out what's happening in the fridge. Um, it's time for breakfast, post-workout meal, and guess what I'm having? You guessed eggs, you're right. I love eggs a lot. There are a lot of really good health benefits from eggs. Not only are they high in protein, but they have good cholesterol. And your body actually needs the good cholesterol, not the bad, the good. There are actually two different types of cholesterol. There's good cholesterol, the HDL, and then there is bad cholesterol, the LDL. And what happens is the bad cholesterol basically sticks like the inside of your arteries um, and that's what clogs it and causes arterial sclerosis or like heart attacks and strokes and all that nasty bad stuff that nobody wants. Um, but eating good cholesterol actually what it does is it goes through your bloodstream and it grabs onto those bad LDL cholesterols and takes it away from the places it's not supposed to be like in your arteries and transports it to your liver, and then your liver um, basically just gets rid of it out of your body. It breaks it down, um, filters it, gets it out of your body. Um, so good cholesterol is actually good. So eggs are a really great source of good cholesterol. They are high in cholesterol. Um, so if you are someone that does have high cholesterol, make sure you, know, you pay attention to how much you're eating each day. Um, I think the recommended dose of um, cholesterol per day is like 300 milligrams. I know I personally eat more than that, um, but you know, every time I get my cholesterol checked, I never have high cholesterol. So um, I just keep eating eggs and lots of them. Um, I eat a lot of strawberries, and I've got some on my plate here. Turn, whoa, turn the phone quick so you can see. Um, I have, oh, the scale turned off. I've got 120 grams of strawberries. Now, strawberries are awesome because, number one, they taste really good. Um, they're like a nice treat, like candy. Um, the other thing that I love about strawberries is you can get so much more for your, well, bang for your buck. <laughs> um, you can get more, more out of strawberries than you can out of some other fruits. Um, so, like, 120 grams of strawberries is, like, nine carbs. That's it. Whereas, like, probably, I don't know how much a banana is, how many grams of banana is off the top of my head. Um, but I'll put it on the screen here. Um, 120 grams of banana would be so many more carbs than that. Um, like I said, I'll put it on the screen and figure it out for you. But it's, you know, just be smart about the foods that you're eating, especially, um, you know, if you're looking to cut your carbs, um, or you just want to be smart about where you get them from. I mean, I'm all about having more volume, um, so I can have more strawberries for less carbs than I can bananas. So, fun fact of the day eat strawberries. 